Hi, everybody. It's me again. We're here live from the Hyatt Regency Buffalo. And I'm getting the rest of the live stream set up here. Here we go. Ready, good. Now I'm going to get the chat working so we can see see your comments, see your conversation. You can help me. Help me enjoy my evening with conversation. There we go. Okay, I'm going to do a test message. Very creative one. And it's working. We're just waiting for the music to turn, turn off here, ladies and gentlemen. So, Mary, this is the... This is a time of the night we're always wondering if anybody's going to show up or not. It's just some kind of basic human psychology, uh, very predictable, that we go through the, these mental machinations. Around this time of the evening, every Friday, wondering, wondering, as usual. Oh, well, that's a good. Uh, I'm pouring a, pouring a beverage. You could hear that popping open. One of the sound effects we have for you. It's pretty comfortable in here tonight, isn't it, Mary? It's not too warm. Nice. I was thinking that it's not too freezing. And it's not too freezing. Well, you caught the best part of the show. <laughs> yeah, they're we're waiting for me to turn turn off the. Yeah, we wait for them. <laughs> Any excuse to not work. <laughs> no, he looks forward to it. I don't see uh, Nick Otto on the live stream. So it's not officially a start yet. It is Friday, isn't it? Nobody's here. Yeah, this could be the night. Tonight could be the night. This could be the night. Everyone's spectating. At least Holly's here. So it's all happy leaving. Holly. Hi, Holly. Joey's here. That's right. Adjusting the cameras. So let's check all the cameras, shall we? Uh, we got this one looking good. This one looking great. This one killer. What else? What other ones we got? A couple up here. This one, the aquarium shot. This one. We'll put them on rotation. I'll, I'll turn up my uh, phone volume to see, see how the audio sounds while we're waiting. This one? Yeah. We'll put them on. Seems pretty good.
a lot of wires. Balancing a lot of wires on this thing. I think they might have might have forgot about the see Don Don was overconfident. He yeah, thought he, yeah. he thought it was easy. <laughs> yeah, well, it's not as easy as we make it look to, yeah. to have the PA turned off. I'll go up and act like I don't know. He already asked. Okay, that's a good Audrey Clark is here. It's me, everybody. We're waiting for the PA to be turned down, but we could we could start anyway. We'll play along with it. There's Dave, our man Dave. We got some great co-workers here at the Hyatt, don't we? I tuned one more note on the piano tonight, ladies and gentlemen, before I started. It was this one up here. I tuned, that was only one note I needed to tune tonight. I've been dialing the piano in over the last three weeks by uh, giving it a quickie tuning before. I've been working my way across the keyboard. Parks here, Mary. That's great. It's always great when Audrey Clark is here because, because as the ex officio president of the Jackie Jocko fan club and founder in 1953, Audrey Clark lends the evening. Uh, official capacity. Tonight we have some some lawyers stopped by for happy hour from a neighboring law firm. And there's still still some of them uh, stragglers from from their early happy hour. started their weekend a little early. We like to see that here at the Hyatt. store for tonight, Mary. We never know when we cast, when we pull anchor five o'clock every, every week, shove off into the port. Yes, right. The, the SS lounge. We 
We never know what adventures lie ahead in the next three-hour voyage. Abandoning ship. His majesty. Especially play the notes that I that I just tuned. The, actually, the one note I just tuned. This one. I'm gonna play that note as much as possible because I feel like it's my note because because I tuned it. Song he, I, left my heart I can't I can't think of a single song he has not done. Yeah. Right? I know. He's done them all. He had 70 albums full of songs. Those were just the albums. Yeah. Live, live he'd go through like a, a thousand songs a night. He was like another He was the great American songbook as much as anybody. McNeil's doing right now, or McNeil as I get to call her. Me and the Buffalo News get to call her McNeil. I think she does just go by McNeil, doesn't she? Commercial. There was a Charlie. There was a really cool jingle for that. I can't. Charlie. For the Charlie. Yeah, they call her Charlie or something, and she'd get out. Or first, her leg would get out of this big black limo. Oh. You yeah, know, and every and flash bulbs would be going off. They don't use flash bulbs anymore. All right. Yeah. Well, we'll have to ask him about that yeah, when, he, we'll when he arrives. Certainly. Assuming he arrives tonight, I think he would. He was here last week, wasn't he? No. But last week he, he wasn't here. Oh, so he's, so he's probably going to be here this week. Toughest part of the night when when there's no ruckus. I like ruckus. I feed off ruckus. In fact, I do the backstroke through ruckus. Oh my goodness! I thought she went, I thought she was on her way back to weaving her way down. Ladies and gentlemen, she's here. Janet is here at Lounge Academy. 
she surprised me. I thought she was going back to Florida the long way. She came up here to go to the KE, Kenmore East. 50 year reunion, that is. Where she was the queen of the reunion. And she gave everybody COVID. What do you make of that? Everybody, how come everybody in our class got COVID? I, th I think I had it. But I might have given it to everybody because I, I think I got it first. I had it, um, but I mean, I don't know that I had it. But I had, I had symptoms on, on uh, Sunday. I woke up with it on Sunday. Now, that would be kind of fast unless I got it on Friday. sequence. This goes out to Vince Michaels, my long lost friend. I haven't seen him in weeks. He's in demand. I hope Andrea comes by tonight. She was here last week and I hardly got to say hello to her. We were cranking so much. And she was so in demand. His stage name is Les Crasher. What's the story behind that name, Vince? It's a cool name. I gather that you've been using that moniker for quite some time. I'm sure it's steeped in meaning. did a song. Little professional trick. Little hack. And show business hack. Vince, he will call again. And you will fall again. His words of love that aren't true. You'll open up the door and let him in once more, and you'll believe his lies. You always do. A great song. Here comes Frederick, ladies and gentlemen. Time to turn up the mic. It's Frederick. Nice to see 
you, Frederick. She just gave you COVID. She gave our entire class COVID. camera on. <laughs> Europe was combined. Yeah, yeah, the worst possible camera, the most boring one, my, my face. We all need less pressure. I, what we do, we all, especially when less pressure is Vince. Vince Michaels. We need more Vince Michaels, that's for sure. We all do that. sloppy tune-up. Sounds pretty good, too. song in my ear earlier that they were playing. We got them. You know what? You know what makes me feel really good, Vince Michaels? About four weeks ago, the hotel switched their uh, their music over to, the, to the, the standards. You know, when we're setting up for a couple hours, like it's like a jazz club now. these great songs and there was one they were playing it's always hard to think of a song when you're playing something else especially if you're me You're going to be 70 on Sunday. Yeah, I know. Thank, thank goodness for Wegmans for making us feel young. It is a little nutty, though, isn't it? Well, congratulations on the big 7-0. I forgot your, uh, you got me, you got me by a couple of years. I just assume I'm older than everybody. Well, you 
look young as ever, you know, forever young. That's a, that's an advantage, Vince. You're see, you're, you're, you're you think ahead. You were bald when you were eight years old, and now it looks like you're not you're not aging. It. That's brilliant. Why I should not be surprised. when the piano is tuned like this. You hardly have to do anything and it sounds nice. It's like splashing around in a pool after dropping acid. We watched a documentary about LSD a couple nights ago. It was, it was about Timothy O'Leary. It was a documentary on Timothy O'Leary. It was like an hour and a half long. And it was riveting. I mean, we, th we think we do goofy things, you know, in this day and age, right? Like, like we, can't, we can't believe the nonsense that goes on. You know, the more things change, the more they stay the same. Everybody thought it was cool to drop acid in the 60s. <laughs> Vince, you probably dropped acid. You're an experimental kind of guy. I never did that. People just thought I was. song that uh, the, the great Gary Marino made famous. We'll sing it in his honor. Marino and Tony Bennett, two of the greats.
Betty Ross. <laughs> this is McGarry Marino's song. Somebody said. Sounds great, doesn't it? I've been tuning it. Yeah, I fixed it. I, I got it. I came in and I got it. How's things in France right now? Are they they tuned in? I don't see her. She hasn't said ah yet. On her way home. Okay. small world here at Lounge Academy. Those were the pictures of the girls. It was a, it was a tough school. Cockers. I see. What a what a great distinction to have. We've never done this one at Lounge Academy. Frederick.
What's on your mind, Frederick? Ooh, yeah, that George is on his mind. Maybe George will be here tonight. It could be a girl. Maybe it is about a girl. Comes as sweet and clear. Oh, is that moonlight through the pines? You'll be pretty good if you can squeeze in there. It makes it skinnier. <laughs> if you put it like this, somebody can put money in it. <laughs> Perfect, thank you. Smile and say, like that. You don't have to pay my bill. Make sure I get out of here without making It's like a sobriety test. If she passed it, she better, better have a few more drinks. Ryan's here, ladies and gentlemen. Lions old fashioned. Nice to see you, Ryan. Here's one we haven't done in like 15 years, Ryan. This was uh, Corbett's, Corbin's, Corbin's, the Corbin's song that Jocko used to play for them.
When the kids grow up and leave us, just we two, Darby and John, who used to be Jack and Phil. Sun was ahead of its time. Oscar Hammerstein, the, the folks who live on the hill. Got to go to the uh, the COVID testing center. Oh, how nice! I like the way you squeezed us in. Make sure you tune in when you're eating so you can ignore your family. see Janet from time to time in Buffalo. She might have a reason to come up to Buffalo once in a while. I wouldn't be surprised. I'm just saying I wouldn't be surprised if we found some reason to come to Buffalo once in a while. But you'll fly. Yeah, I don't blame you. That's a long drive. Yeah. Or take a train. Might, might as well just fly. Although flying takes a while too. By the time they finally get you there. There she goes. to the keys. Buffalo's not going to seem the same without Janet. The Florida Keys. Key West. Where else?
stuff in there. Frederick's used on a lot of dates. We'll have this moment forever, but never ever again. How could they resist that? <laughs> from my bar than I usually am.
Cadillac is, is Cadillac is in the house. Hi, Catherine. Catherine saying hi from Paris, and Amy is saying hi from from our very own hood somewhere. Great to see Amy. She's saying hi, everyone. Yeah, she can see you right now. There you go, Amy. He's toasting you right now. my tomorrows. Jimmy Van Heusen and Sammy Kahn. Jim Trimper, is that really you out there? Big guy, big, big person. That'd be great if you were. If you're jumping in to say hi. See Buffalo. We do this every Friday night. With or without an audience.
there he is. Hi, Jim. Sir. Big person. Mr. Trimper says hi, Mary. How's everything? How's your summer? Probably doing some interesting things. You're never not doing interesting things. We know that. None of the trippers ever do not interesting things. Control your politics. So of at least a small percent of me do. Cause I love a of you. from Silk Stockings. He wrote the words and the notes to all his music. piano like a, a foot further away from my wet bar than I usually do apparently. It's very quiet here in the Hyatt, except for me. It's 
very peaceful in here other than other than my contribution. Somebody loves you. It's no good unless she loves you. I think, I think you deserve one, Vince, Vince Michaels. A nine-footer, a D. A double D. This is a song that's uh, technically it's an oxymoron. It's called. 
called Alone Together. I just have to mig mig migrate into the key it's in. and Schwartz. From Flying Colors.
dumb anything goes. You know what this is the verse to? Must get down to work the times. Relax, relieve the tension. No matter what the progress and what yet may be proved, the simple facts of life are such they cannot be removed. You must remember this. A kiss is still a kiss. And a sigh is just a sigh. As time goes by. people could name who wrote that song even though everyone knows the song somehow play it play it for me i think she says play it for me we just saw that scene i don't know pianos are getting expensive aren't they <laughs> Jim Trimper Sr. said, hi, Mary. Yeah, that is funny, too. Uh, need a CB set to break into our conversation. Sellers. Great having you with us. Oh, at last. Oh, my love is come. a song
Frederick has never known. Oh, you smile. And then the spell was cast. right because it followed the laws of nature frederick not this not this polite society we live in now cavemen and discussion group they called it presentism where you judge things today and you judge the past by today's oh that's an interesting judging the past by today's sensibilities Protesting rather than up in the stands saying, Yes, and then the lions, you right? Know, yeah, you know. he said, Supposed to everybody had slaves, you know, not a condoning, you're just saying, the, win, the winners, the winners had them, and the losers didn't, well, uh, and everyone took turns. That's what I mean, whoever, whoever won the war had them. That's it, the one who wins makes the history. Too. That's right. <laughs> crazy stuff that went in went on through history Frederick I'm just glad I'm just sitting in a lounge at a piano you know Janet's got her whole fam family listening in the lounge Academy welcome Janet's family Are you out at a uh, restaurant or sitting around a, the dining room, maybe? Ten people to write a song. Janet's at home. Still home. I'm a little confused. What is home since you live in Key West? Diane is here. It's Lady Di. Thank you, Patrick. 
King of the Valleys. Thank, thank goodness Diana's here. We need an adult. We need adult supervision around here. I haven't been out to dinner in a long time, so I'm looking forward to this. Going along for the ride, right from here. I can see this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. This is a song about a friendship goes haywire, probably after a bunch of drinks, and all of a sudden it became a, becomes a romance. Imagine that. I can't imagine that. But a lot of people tell me it's happened to them. Where you're, you know, you're with your friends, your friend and all of a sudden, I don't know, maybe there's some drinks involved and the friendship ends and it becomes a romance. That's why they invented drinks. That's why they call it a social lubricant. It's kind of an industrial sounding description, isn't it? Like Teflon or something. WD-40. This is the end of a beautiful friendship. Sister and brother, till tonight when we, till we looked at each other, that was the end of a beautiful friendship, and it was just, just the beginning. Just the beginning of love. Diane's been there.
like sister and brother. Till tonight, when we looked at each other, that was the end of a beautiful friendship. Come on over here and sit in the co-pilot seat with me. That's a good point. I mean, is there any re any reason to? Well, they've been saving a lot of people's health by not using seed oils to make those donuts. A pound of sugar isn't as healthy for you with seed oil. Controversial could a donut be for crying out loud? Uh, I draw the line with trans fat. I mean, why, why shouldn't they have the same fat as the rest of us? We'll just use the iron, use the real thing. Our donuts use the iron. Yeah, the city of Buffalo Department of Coffee and Donuts. We use 100% iron. None of that tallow garbage like the competition uses. Sometimes people would ask, you know, so we'd lie when, when they'd ask. And we'd say, come fly with me. Exotic bulls, it's far and far Bombay. Fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away. Oh, come fly with me, let's float down to Peru. In Lama Land, there's a one man band to do this food for you. Fly with me, let's take off. Once you get up there, where the air is rarefied, we'll just glide, starry-eyed. Up there, I'll be holding you so near. You may hear angels cheer on a kind of way together, so weather-wise, it's such a 
Sammy Khan. A very popular song, but a lot of people probably don't know who wrote it. side is for Diane. They say, I'll move the mountains, and I'll move the mountains, if she wants them out of the way.
Joey. This is Diane. and Schwartz. and heart. Take my jacket off. What the heck? Just because I can. 
Johnny Mercer. A couple of Irish boys. Take home and request. Introduced around 1959 on the Playboy Penthouse Black and White 1959 TV show by Psych Holman, writ for Frank Sinatra. Some habits even Nick can't explain. I'll start for the corner. Turn up. Now the party's gonna start, ladies and gentlemen. Why try? 
try to change me now. I'll sit and I'll daydream. Kathy, I've got daydreams galore. Cigarette ashes. There they go on the floor. I'll go away weekends. Leave the keys in the door. Why try to change me now? Why can't I be more conventional? People talk, people stare, so I try. It's not for me, cause I can't see my kind of crazy world go passing me by. So let people wonder, let them laugh, let them frown. style is I was always your clown why try to change me why try to change me why try to change me now the great Cy Coleman starting to come alive now, Frederick. To take that ride again, I'm starry eyed again, taking a chance on love. They said the game was a frame up, I never would try. Now I'm taking that game up, and the ace of hearts is high. Things are mending now, I see the rainbows blending now. We'll have that happy ending now. Taking a chance on love. Ooh, yeah. Taking a chance.
I got one. No, oh, you've got one. Okay, I'm gonna take this one. That way I only have to keep track of one at a time. <clears throat> the days, days of wine and roses, laugh and run away. Why could child? Mark nevermore that wasn't there before. A lonely night discloses just a passing breeze filled with memories. Introduced me to the days of wine and roses, and you Mancini and Johnny Mercer wrote that chestnut. It's one o'clock in Paris. They should change their time to New York time for Frederick. The girls in Paris.
Yes, I did. I never dreamt it could be. But there you were. I saw your lips next to mine, so I kissed them. You didn't mind it at all. When I'm away, such a break never happens. How long can a guy go on dreaming? If there's a chance that you care. My baby, say it and make my, make my crazy dreams come true. Say it and make my crazy dreams true. for Brian Bond. He's out there cleaning something. is alcoholic. We're drinking ginger beer, which is non non-alcoholic with vodka. Much of a hangover from that drink. Right? Yeah, vodka. You don't get a hangover from vodka. And ginger is like it's like medicine. You take ginger for a for a hangover. So this is like a preemptive hangover medicine. Everyone has a favorite. Nothing wrong with Marianne. Or, or even the um, millionaire's wife. This was, what was her name? This was Lovey or whatever it was. Lovey. I could go for, you know. There's nothing wrong with doing business with a go with a an established concern. That's what my father used to tell me. He was a CPA, so he used to put, distill all of life's lessons down into like accounting solutions.
my baby Till that lucky day You know darn well Baby the stars out tonight I don't know if it's cloudy or bright cause I only have eyes for you dear the moon may be high song. Harry Warren and Al Duman, no wonder it's a good song. Those guys are writers. Thank you, Kathy. That's from Danes. 
show called Days. I was doing all right. Nothing but rainbows in my sky. I was doing all right till you, till you came by. Had no cause to complain. Life was as sweet as apple pie. Never noticed the rain. And suffer all the day. I just keep on wondering if life isn't one big wonder. But when you hold me tight, tangling all through, I feel somehow I was doing all right. But I'm doing better. Ever now First one from the Goldwyn Follies You're watching Lounge Academy. Live streaming from the Hyatt Regency Buffalo in the, the heart of downtown Buffalo's entertainment district. And we do this live every Friday night. You can see the train going by in the background. It's nice of the couple of people on the train there to give me the thumbs up. It's nice they give me a little encouragement. I, I think it was their thumbs. Yeah. 
Minnelli. He wrote this song after that, which explains a few things. Well, that things didn't work out too well in the relationship, and Judy Garland for introducing him in the first place. I don't know. Who knows? I just, I would have loved to have been a fly on the wall at their dinner, their Thanksgiving dinners. Imagine the things he learned. Yeah. Yeah. You could tell he did, too. That's right. That's right. Alexa or whatever it's called. You're right. third period action. It's really great. It was a little peaceful earlier in the night. One of those occasional summer nights when no one's there. And suddenly that all changed.
continuing with our B-flat medley. Howard. To me, that's one of the one of the core piano bar songs. Thank you for coming by so much. Wonderful to see. You. Have a great evening. Great evening of entertainment down here in the theater district of Buffalo. through the B-flat songs, Diane. Let's see how many we got left that I can think of. There's this one, and then there's this one. I've never been in love Safe. 
thought I knew the score But this is wine That's all too strange and strong I'm full of foolish song And out my song must pour So please forgive this Helpless haze I mean I've never really been in love before nothing, no one's sitting there.
That was a Luther song. that song. Yes, he did. You think I know where that song is by now? I was first in line for it. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, that same gentleman has another piano that he's... he's oh, it doesn't have strings, though, or something, right? right? Well, you need to, you need to, to play around with putting strings in a piano. Yeah, yeah. Good, good one to learn on, right? A free one, right? Are you going to do that? No. I have plenty of pianos. Oh. Me too, but that Mason Hamlin, I couldn't resist that. Yeah. I love those pianos. I used to rehearse on Mason Hamlin's at Duke University. They had them in the old ones in their, uh, you know, their rehearsal rooms. And I, I liked them, you know. And, It's nice, one less thing they have to pay in my estate. Yes. If they ask me, Dan could write a book. And how? About the way you walk. Whisper and look. Could write the preface on how we met. Let the world would never forget. And the simple secret of the plot. Just to tell them that I love you a lot. The world discovers when my book ends how to make two, make two lovers of friends. Joey, Rogers and Hart. to do it. 
I've got a crush on you Sweetie pie All the day and night time Hear me sigh I've never Had the least bit notion Gershwin, beautiful Gershwin song. Thank you, Diane. It gets quiet in here when I stop making a racket. Tony Bennett tonight, which is pretty easy. He did every song. He did them all. Made them all his.
I've been saying in December Long before the springtime is due Thank you, Vince. Thank you, Joyce. Nice having you with us tonight. On this beautiful summer night. Here in the 
lounge capital of Buffalo, New York. could write a song like that. He could feel the pain, couldn't he? Making million dollars a song, he could still feel the pain. That's an artist. to 
leave everybody as depressed as possible. I'm a fool to want you. I'm a fool to want you. To want a love that can't be true. A love that's there for others too. I'm a fool to hold you. Such a fool to hold you. To seek a kiss, not mine alone. To share a kiss the devil has known. a broken heart right there. You don't want to be in those shoes. Kind of makes, you know, they're so, these so these songs are so heartbreaking. It makes you feel good just because, like, it's not happening to you this moment. Right? Makes you feel lucky. Man, where did this night go?
Um, you know, I don't. I, I stick them back on, though. I, I brought archival scotch tape so I can keep them maintained. Let's see. Here's one for you. This one here. <laughs> Christine he will call again. And you will fall again. For his words of love that are in truth. the door. I think Dan has this on a piano roll. <laughs> and let him in once more. And you'll believe his lies. You always do. He'll hurt you and then He'll call again. You should give him up. You know it's true. But you're much too weak to fight his charms. So you'll run right back to song off of Jocko's list. Thank you. Do you happen to play quarter to nine? 42nd Street? Yeah, let me see if we we got it in a book. I'm not sure if it's in the... Find it for me. See if it's in one of these three books. Oops. forget out there she knows who she is get what's that Gretchen gets how little we know how much to discover what chemical forces flow from lover to lover Touches off that tingle, that sudden explosion when two angles intermingle. Who cares to define what chemistry Nick is? Who cares with your lips on mine? What ignorant bliss is? As long as you kiss me and the world around us shatters, how little it matters. 
VIP Davenport. This is a great request. That we haven't had this one like in recent memory. Somewhere there's music. Paint the two somewhere there's heaven. How high the moon! There is no moon above when love is far away too. Until it comes true that you love me and I love you. Where there's music, it's where you are. Somewhere there's heaven. How near or far? The darkest nights would shine if you would come to me soon. Until you. Quest, thank you.
Vegetable stand. Starting to wrap up. Ramp up. You're uh, growing at an incredible rate. Have you noticed that? I hope you're not, I hope you're not afraid of heights. You might have to practice climbing ladders just to get an idea of what it's going to feel like tomorrow, right? <laughs> oh, you like to climb? Nice. That's a good. That's a good skill to be able to climb. You can either climb or you can't. You know. But the hike doesn't bother you. See, that's. See, I'm in the camp of I'm scared of heights. Actually, it's not the heights that bother me, it's climbing that bothers me. Like, if it's not up to me to hang on, I'm fine. Like, in an airplane or a helicopter with the doors off or something, I'm fine. But if I'm climbing a ladder, forget about it. But, you know, it's just something. Something just takes over. It's like seems like okay this is gonna be no big deal this is safe I'm gonna do it then you go and do it and it's like just something we're climbing pear trees shake like a hard guy that's it see that was a good exit that was a hard guy exit throws the furniture into a tree that's the idea always leave an impression in something <laughs> or someone can you believe the night went so quickly Mary <laughs> It's 8.20. It seems like we just started because everybody just got here. The first two hours nobody was here. Unless you count Frederick. He counts as 10. And France was tuned in. Friday night doing this. This is what we do. We lounge every Friday night at the Hyatt from 5 to 8. We also live stream it, so wherever, in case you're not stranded in Buffalo on a Friday night, you can still join us and chat, listen, right on Facebook.
glad to hear that, Janet. Oh, oh thanks, Vince. Vince, uh, Vince Michael, Vince's wife Jane likes your dress, Mary. She's in another world. I'm going to need a CB set with Channel 19 to break in. Got time to, you got time to get it. It takes me three hours to pack up. <laughs> Mrs. Vince Michaels, known as Jane, likes your dress, Mary. We're going to give it to Jane. Live on the show. Frederick, full of fun. Frederick and Ari and Marino seem to be the ideal. Yes, the good wife lets you hide all the sadness you feel. Last request. Well, we'll see you next week. Exactly seven days, less three and a half hours. Each Friday, five to eight.
I know, but I know it stays light out. It gets lighter. It's getting lighter and lighter. It, as we're sitting here, it's getting brighter. Oh, that sounds wonderful. A little lemon sauce. Oh, really? 